After reporting all the news of this dramatic week, sometimes it's good just to head into the weekend with a smile. And in 12 days, a movie will enter the theaters brought to life by Will Ferrell, our person of the week, and a famously steady family guy out in Hollywood. Ten years ago, he created Ron Burgundy, the pompous newsman, who is once again going to get laughs at the expense of those of us who work on TV. I look good. I mean, really good. I'm Ron Burgundy? He's become a kind of national belly laugh. Ron Burgundy, a TV anchor puffed up on self-importance and hairspray. Of course, you know what I'm thinking first, which is... Is my hair right? Oh, your hair looks wonderful. Yeah, Ron would. <laughs> yes. Ron would want to run his fingers through your hair and <laughs> smell it. What's the question Ron Burgundy most wants to ask Ron Burgundy? He would just say, Ron, how do you do it? Look at you. How do you do it? And he would just stare open mouthed. <laughs> And in the world of comedy, Will Farrell is an impossibility. Kind, very tall. He says in high school, the only way he could get a girl's attention and sympathy was to be funny. He created a sight gag. A lot of this. <laughs> yeah. We laugh. See? His colleague Tina Fey says something about Farrell is just so American. It's not that I don't get angry. I mean, yeah. you should have seen me five minutes before I walked into this room because yes. someone had brought me a, a latte small subpoena. that was soy and <laughs> I lost it, Diane. I was in tears. And you may not know, in college, Farrell wanted to be a sportscaster. So, I have a test for you. You ready for a pop quiz? Uh, I was not alerted of this. I believe this is sabotage this journalism close here. close to be being one of us. Can you recognize this music? That's all I get. <laughs> Is that <laughs> Richard Brown makes his first big shakeup in the Halo's front office. Wow. But it was short lived, and as we know, he ended up on Saturday Night Live. I gotta have more cowbell. After that, movie after movie proved irresistible, yet with all the success. Farrell has been married 12 years to the same woman. We ask if he thought he was a good father since we saw his three kids laughing with him and at him what? at the Emmys. No, you cannot play Angry Birds right now. No, just. They said, that was fun. Okay, um, can we go eat ice cream now? And uh, I was like, sure, you it guys did great. great. Yeah. It's just, that's not life. Yeah, this that's not life. life and um, uh, so, but in answer to your question, yes, mm -hmm. I'm, a, I'm a hell of a father. Yeah. 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 Pretty much perfect. And I'm I feeling know, here. I pretty much know all their ages. <laughs> the youngest. Yeah, I do. Yeah. So in 12 days, welcome Ron Burgundy back again. The guy who almost didn't happen. We got rejected, I think, 10 times by 10 different studios as we tried to pitch a comedy about news, and everyone was like, Really? And I did don't they ever know. come to you and say we were wrong? Oh, we were totally no, wrong. no. The the Hollywood version is, we always liked it, <laughs> but we just didn't know it would be like that. Not bad for a nice guy finishing first. Not bad for getting the last laugh. My motto's always been, when it's right, it's right my way. <laughs>